all right so what is going on today youtube back again with some more videos sorry for not uploading on friday thursday was my birthday so i did not record and uh my birthday didn't turn out the way i wanted it to so that was um it was a bit much but uh yeah we're just gonna get straight into it so uh once again uh like i said uh last week oh he surrendered okay well like i said last week what we're going to be doing is basically taking those tech cards um like well i didn't make a video uh, okay yo well, instead of making uh, like just a one-off video what i'm going to do is take some of the tech cards that i think are going to be very good for this uh meta or you know for this format and then insert them into decks and see pretty much how they work today we're going to be playing my orcus zombie deck and we're going to be playing our tech mistake now um this card like i said is, is, it's really good you do have to go first i feel like that's an understatement but even if your opponent if your opponent doesn't go off going turn one mistake can still help you turn two and basically later on in the game it can be very helpful um against a multitude of decks hopefully we get to play one today but our opponent decides he wants to uh in the in the duel early so we all right so yeah hopefully we do get to get a match and we do get to end up going first so let's see if we can do oh no this hand is just this is what you could this is the monster this is literally the best opening hand you can probably open oh wait never mind i don't know why i said that because i'm not actually able to do anything but sadly we already have a monster reborn so yeah man this is once again one of those hands where it's just 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 it's just too good it's just too good if you lose with these type of hands you just deserve to lose here uh we're gonna just add a mizuki for the fun of it because like i said we if you start with a, a ritual summon and a uh slayer you're, you're just like 400 percent in the duel he's probably gonna quit because like i said this is just a monstrous hand so let's see what we can really accomplish here um slayer and a uh, go mizuki activate so here we're going to add the evolution um and then here oh we're going to dump battle lord okay i totally forgot about that i was like oh wait, wait a minute i don't want to search yet so we haven't got what's the name so we're going to grab a solitary here because like i said we're just fixing our hand now at this point does not matter anymore before it used to matter now it doesn't matter since we play uh, what's the name the incantations in this deck it does not matter even if you draw your rituals like I, like I said it doesn't really matter um so here uh you technically want to call traps because you do have a call by the grave that you could just use on your opponent so it doesn't really matter um like i said man thanks to the chalice lines being in the deck you're able to uh basically resolve that at any given point in time so we're going to add here our slayer because it kind of we have to send with the striders now like i said you can send core and core will trigger what's the name so i think we might go that route but once again the West, once we get the four star out of the deck he's going to add a ritual so actually what the five star is actually going to add the ritual spell back so like i said it's up to you right now just to show you guys how it really works we're going to send the striders here striders is going to trigger you're going to reveal the slayer here um bam 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 hopefully we don't mess this up because uh, if we mess it up we're just uh, i'm just going to be frustrated here um so here we're going to get the mizuki because like i said we do have all this you know all, all the goodness here um i don't know what our opponent is playing so you know we do have a unicorn so I, I feel better using the cerberus than using the uh phoenix because like i said if our opponent has a chance to beat us um he's going to be able to so here we're going to did we get we did we get i don't think we got shinobi's effect no we didn't get shinobi's effect huh we did not we did not get shinobi's effect but that's that's going to be okay we're going to figure out, out a way to get around that so here i'm going to go into the griffin uh griffin is going to discard the mizuki because like i said we searched it earlier we're going to set the monster reborn because our parent I, I, I was about to say our parents but <laughs> we do not um oh there's another mizuki that's actually broken um here so we're going to actually grab banshee do we got banshee or a gozuki here we're going to have another chance anyway so i think we're going to just grab banshee here we're just gonna grab banshee um um and like i said you can wait for this it doesn't really matter um but you're gonna grab goblin zombie here we're gonna use this guy to go into the mermaid so we haven't drawn none of our uh orchids cards and now it doesn't matter because we're gonna pre pretty much be able to oh wait fuck i was supposed to use oh thank god all right so we're gonna use banshee here because we're not playing curious or anything in this deck and we also took out what's the name 
Uh, we're going to just try to build the best what we actually can build. So we're going to use all four of these to go into a skull deed and bam and bam. Let's see what we can actually draw here. Double mistake. All right. So that's already cool. We already have multiple what's names. We don't need this slayer and we don't need a pre prep. And we just, we can, I guess, put a designator back to the deck. Um, yeah, we can just put a designator back. All that's going to be fine and dandy. So here, I guess we could add. No, I don't know. I'm not going to add Gozuki. I'm going to add probably another Solitaire, I suppose. So here, we're going to do some fun stuff here. We're going to do a lot of fun stuff here. We're going to use this. We're going to try to build the best board we actually can. So with this, we're going to tribute, bring out uh, you and the zombie. Um, I don't need to really be putting it at that. I don't really need to be putting under Skull D, but it's all right. Um, I don't think, you know, I think, are we not going to have a Jusha? No, no, we were going to have a Jusha. Okay, so he did quit. Um, pretty much what we're going to do is uh, send Gozuki, special summon Mizuki, and then we're going to sink those, we're going to sink those two into an Omega. Then we're going to banish the card out of his hand, right? And then what we're going to do is use Mizuki to bring back Gozuki. Gozuki can then send Jushel for next turn. And then what we can do is just start doing our, uh, what's the name? Because one of them is a tuner. I think the, no, the one star is a tuner. So then after that, what we could have did uh, was um, basically use the Chalice Slime to, uh, if it's a discard a card out of our hand, which is most likely probably going to be Solitaire. So we could have actually grabbed another Mizuki. Uh, actually, I think we had, I think we had the maximum number of Mizukis. But if we did have, no, we didn't have another Mizuki. We could have actually added Core. So then what we're going to do is bring out the Bookstone. Bookstone is going to add the Origin back from the graveyard. You're going to activate Origin, tributing Bookstone and the Shinobi Necro that's in our graveyard. Special Summoning Slayer. Shinobi Necro comes back. So then there's another eight right there. That's already two eights. And then after that, we were just going to do the, uh, we're going to do the standard uh, Orchids combos to draw two cards, put the cards back, and then literally have two, mis we, that two mistakes set. We have uh, basically three negations. And like I said, you could do a lot more with this deck, but like I said, this is just bare bones, just showing you how the deck works. Um, all right, so let's get up out of here. Let's get another... All right, going against X Hero, do we win the Rock, Paper, Scissors? No, we sadly do not. Um, now, what I do want to try to do is incorporate hand traps into this deck. This hand is nice. Hand is nice. This hand is nice. Hey, this hand is nice. Hand ain't nice no more. Hand is not nice anymore. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right. So, yeah, mate, like I said, man, it is what it is. Oh, you're playing this deck. Um, he has to probably, he's probably gonna hit the nightmare. 100% is gonna hit the nightmare. Um, you can't hit this and putting, why would you put a card that I can revive? Okay. Anyways, see, look, mistake against this would have been fantastic. Activate Nessie, flip mistake. You're not able to add the Jackalope, all right? And then you're gonna go to his old, try to add off of that. You can't add, but then after that, I mean, then it gets kind of a little weary here. Hopefully we could just, just hit all the uh, Jackalopes. We're gonna just pick far right, right there. Though we hit the Jackalope. All right, so that's the best thing you can do against a, 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 a Danger Jack is to, tr um, it was not really in your control, but if you could hit, if you could hit all the what's the names, you're just, you're, you're fine. If you keep hitting all the dangers, they don't get no pluses. They have to keep other cards sitting in their hand. So that that's a good thing. So you just have to try to get lucky here. Um, so what's going on here? Okay, you're just going straight into the nightmares. I mean, going straight into the orcas. Oh no, he's getting double, uh, double what's the name? Double effect of uh, Neo spacing because now he contribute, uh, connect, he contribute connected to bring back Aqua Dolphin and get another rip out of my hand, which I'm technically, uh, I, I, it's just, I suppose that's what he did that for. No, okay. Um, well, he has to do it before he uses any of the orcas effect. So, oh yeah, he has Phantasmi. But that wouldn't it wouldn't have mattered because if we would have basically once we would resolved all of our plays we would have actually yeah once we would have got to battle lord i said we would turn that off um so there he's going to orcas gelada so now he has to use connector if he's going to actually uh want to get another he doesn't want to get another card i don't know why you don't want to do that is this a free hit two cards out of my hand i'm thinking the reason why he didn't do that is because he didn't want me to uh either he needs the does he need the four do they need the four? I think they kind of do. Uh, no, they don't. They don't need the four, right? I would suspect that they don't. Um, so here you're going to go. Okay, no, I think you do need the four. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. I didn't know you needed the four. Um, so yeah, he's going to pretty much lock us out of the door here. 
Wait, what do they what do they set off of this? I know they don't use what's the name. I know they don't use Prime. Don't they, they use a field spell, right? Okay, they do use a field spell. Okay. Um so I guess right now he's gonna go to Brigadine. Brigadine's gonna set the trap and he's gonna be able to special summon and then go on a Western name, yeah. Okay. No, you go huh? I'm just confused. Maybe I don't understand this. Gotta get Armageddon Knight, so that's that's what it is. Ancient Kluke. What? Okay, oh okay. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I don't know, man. I, I ain't played against this shit. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Um, so he has to use those. Did he? He fucked up, right? Because Brigadine is down. Is left down. Oh, wait. What? When the fuck did Brigadine. God damn it. I didn't know Brigadine was right. I mean, it's, I mean, I played with it a couple of times. It is right on, yeah. All right. So, no, he didn't fuck up. Or of course he didn't fuck up, folks. See, this is where Darkhold, Regeki, and all this shit comes into play. Because here, you can just freely destroy your opponent. And they, you know, that they wasted pretty much all their resources. Uh, why are you grabbing Fog Blade, sir? Do you already have the trap? Are you that... F oh, my God. He's just that good. Um, and another good thing about this is that you can literally... What does this do? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, damn. I thought this shit would work regardless. Oh, God. This doesn't target, does it? Oh, it doesn't really matter anyways. Um, oh, look at that, man. Look at the fucking mistake that came through. That's crazy. So, yeah, like I said, we do have one chance to do something. But like I said, we're not able to actually do anything. Uh, I really wish that this shit. Wait, what one? Oh, target of monsters you control. Why? Oh, why? So we could just get Nessie. We could just get Nessie and just wait. I think that might be. I think that might just happen, huh? If we just get Nessie and wait, what can he do? What can he do if we just get Nessie? Or we can just get uh no, because then he'll just link it off. So yeah, we're just gonna get Nessie. He's 2800. So we're gonna get Nessie. Um, he's going to chain his uh, rank up magic to basically stop everything I got going on here. There we go. So, but he's only twenty four hundred. So, what else can the deck do besides that? Like, we're like, be. I, I just want to be honest. What else does the deck do? Because I, I don't, I don't think it doesn't really do anything. Like, as I thought, it doesn't really do anything. We'll just put Nessie right there to just block that off. Oh, does that pop? I don't know if it popped, but yeah. So this is a fog blade, and like I said, we're just in my turn. Um, what else does he do? What else does the deck do after that? I don't know what else the deck does. Okay. Oh, you can go Boral Sword. Wait, what? Okay, it's not a dark. So he's sending to set. Okay, that's fine. I can't, can't stop that. So he can go Boros. Or can he kill me? Can he kill me, folks? Y'all gotta let me know if he can kill me. If he can kill me, I'm gonna be very upset. I'm gonna be very upset at y'all because y'all let him kill me. Y'all 100% let this man kill me. I don't appreciate that. But if you go Boros Sword, oh, you can't go Boros Sword. Oh my God, you can't go Boros Sword. He has to have a monster in his hand. Can he not fucking go? Boros? What the? Why is this deck so good? See, I can understand the Lunar Light one, because they put up a 3,500 beater that I think attacks twice, unless I'm mixing that with Raid Raptors. I think their 3,500 motherfucker can attack twice. I, I think it did. Wait. I think, yeah, it does attack twice, right? I'm not understanding. So this literally, this this is why I'm talking. What are you going to? Oh, Unicorn. Okay. He's going to, he has to spin this back, because he can't do anything. Yeah. He, <laughs> he, bro, what is going on? Like, that, that should not be, that's not right, is it? Oh, it gets banished if it's special? No, it doesn't, huh? Oh, okay. Well, this comes out in defense. So what does that do? What does that do, sir? Doesn't do shit. Wait, do you even have a danger? Oh, you have Jackalope. Okay. So this deck is just literally just turn one. If they can't see, this is why what's the name is good, man. 
Now, I, I can't flip this mistake because if I flip this mistake, I'm in trouble because I won't be able to do shit. That's going to fuck me over, but I don't have to. Wait, this comes out and attack? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead and do what you guys think. All right. All right. Hey. Wow. I really thought that this deck... Okay. All right. So, yeah, like I said, man, Dark Hole, Regeki really just puts everything... See, he's even playing Regeki because he knows once... So, okay, I can understand why the Lunar Light deck won. 100%, I can understand. So you just have to fight around two Fog Blades, which is very hard to do once you have hands like this. But I think we can. I 100% think we can. So we'll start with this. He can't really stop anything, so it doesn't really matter. We'll discard that, and we'll get the Candall out. <gasps> oh, my God, watch this, folks. Oh, I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh, I can't do it. Uh, I can't do it. That's fine. Um, yeah, that's that's completely fine. So what we're gonna, okay? I th I think we can get out of this. I think we can get out of this. So here we're gonna go first burial. We're gonna send Shinobi Necro, right? We're gonna send Shinobi Necro, cause then yeah, that comes once again. We once we utilize all these cards, Shinobi Necro comes out, and then also since he negated with my Fog Blade, we're able to actually. Uh, we're able to actually do more now. So we're going to use Shinobi Necro's effect. We can also go what's the name too. Now quiet is kept. Quiet is kept, bros. We can actually go into our level seven Cyverse card. Can this, when this, when it, well, while you control this card, cannot be targeted. The opponent cannot target cards except this one. Okay, well, no, that doesn't work. Okay, so we go Phoenix to pop this. He's going to, he's going to have to do something. And then we can just do the nightmare shit. All right, so let's let's fucks with that today. Let's just fucks with that today. We use these two. Go right into a phoenix. Phoenix is gonna. Phoenix is gonna just pop this. Which he's. I mean, he, at this point, if he's gonna use it. He's gonna. Yeah, like I said, it doesn't really matter. So here, this is only when a zombie is special summoned from our graveyard. So, what we have to try to do is get lucky here. So we're gonna actually. Like, it doesn't really matter. Increase this. You can just train the fog blade, but like I said, that doesn't matter. I'm gonna send the four. Um, we did draw a mistake, but like I said, we didn't go first. If we would have went first, I think we probably would have got this young man. So there's a bunch of shit that we can actually do to win this game. We draw a unit zombie, we win the game. We it's a bunch of shit we can do. There's a bunch of shit we can actually draw to actually get us to where we need to do. But there's also a bunch of shit we we can draw that can't get us anywhere. So that's going to be the problem here. So here, what I'm going to do is just put back Orphagel Driver because that is a card. No, actually, we're going to put back Nightmare so we can use uh, we can use uh, Mermaids to just bring it out to get an extra card. That's literally the only reason why we're going to do it. Um, I did not fuck up, did I? The three stars in the grave, correct? All right. So we literally have to just get off this, and we're, we're able to just do some bunch. We have to just do a bunch of shit here. Oh my God! Oh, oh dear! Oh, oh, you gotta sing it with your fellas. I'm sorry, folks. I just had to. I just had to do that. I just had to do that. I just had to do that. Fucks with your boys. Fucks with your boys, bro. God damn, this was good. We're gonna put that right there. Why? Because I know what you're wondering. Well, how are you gonna get out of this, folks? Listen. When you play zombies, you're able to do a shitload of things with just a little bit of cards. We're sending Banshee, and Banshee's going to turn everything into zombies. And you know what that means, right, folks? Yes, it's exactly what that fucking means. Now Shinobi Necro will trigger when we bring back um, Schizophrenia, which is a Galata. Boom, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Game is over. Game is over. The fuck out of here. Pick your shit up, bro. Pick your shit up. I'm tired of these people. Woo, that was that that's what you call a clutch fucking victory, bros. Clutch. And I mean super fucking clutch. And it's alright, because we're gonna go vampire sucker. I'm not gonna fuck this up. Um, I can use these to go Vampire Sucker. I don't think it matters, but I can use these two to go Vampire Sucker, right? 
And then, um, no, actually, I'm gonna keep this. We can use these two to go vampire. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use these two to go vampire sucker. Why is because I wanted to maximize my potential, folks. He's gonna quit. He's not gonna let. He's not gonna allow me to finish this because he's definitely have to quit. He's garbage. We're gonna send the Battle Lord here, folks. Why? Because Battle Lords is just a fantastic fucking card. And we're gonna just get rid of the Chalice Line because, like I said, we don't really technically. Uh, actually, we can keep the Chalice Line because we just banish anything out of our graveyard. Huh? Oh wait, we have a Chalice Line in the graveyard. Oh, okay. That's what you said. That's fine. Battle Lord effect. Draw one. Draw another card. Draw another fucking card, bros. Oh my god, this game is over, bro. <laughs> Punk motherfucker. God damn, I love this game. God damn it, bro. Oh my god, this is a return to form for us, man. Return to fucking form. So here we're gonna call traps because you won't be he has to I'm gonna force his fucking his fog blades now. Oh, 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 you you don't wanna use fog blades, sir? My okay, my bad. I thought you were an actual good duelist here. You're not. And it's okay. And it's okay, sir. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right, bros. Uh, fuck it. We're just going to add another Chalice Slime. It doesn't really matter. He's not surviving this duel. I'm going to send Stridus. Oh, 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 oh. I still have another target for Stridus, bros. This is what you call a comeback of the ages, bros. A comeback of the fucking ages. All right. So here, um, we're going to target this. And we're going to bring out Young Goblin Zombie right on over there. So... Here, hmm, let's go boar load. I want to go what's the name though? We can go boar load savage dragon. We can, we can clear his board. That's not the problem. I'm trying to go quantum dragon as well. I'm trying to go this, but I don't think I can. I don't think I can go quantum dragon. Right? I don't think I can. Actually, I can. Watch this. So we're gonna increase that <laughs> we're gonna increase that bad boy by uh increase that bad boy by oh and we're also gonna tribute to stridus <gasps> oh my god oh my god oh that's broken so we're gonna go Borload savage over there savage dragon is going to equip the young uh i don't even know what we have in there uh young phoenix the young phoenix then we're going to add uh young mizuki and then so we're going to use this origin we're going to tribute off Stridus and Mizuki. Oh my God, this is broken, bro. Stridus and Mizuki out the hand. Put that right there. So now when he attacks, I also get a what's the name. And then what we can do is use Mizuki to bring my God. <laughs> bro, this is broken. Oh my God, why did y'all tell me I'm this? Y'all just gotta sometimes let give give me my props when I play some of these people. God damn, bros, this is amazing. And then here, we can just literally add another Solitaire for next turn, bros. Um, so literally, we'll be, oh my god, don't quit now. Don't quit now, sir. See, bros. God, oh, that was broken. That was broken. How, oh, that was broken. That was good. That was a good duel. See, this deck is fair. This deck, this deck is fair. Now, that Lunar Light shit may be unfair because he has a 3,500 motherfucker that can attack twice. I believe it can. But you see, this also adds to my point with, uh, with like I said, with what's the name? With uh, with uh, Darko Rigeki. With Darko Rigeki, like, none of this shit really, like, like I said, you, if you could beat over their board, they can't do anything. Just like with the Thunder deck. I, 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 let me not say that. Whoa, whoa, burp, time out. Let me not say that because I'm not sure. I haven't, I've, I've seen the Thunder deck played. I haven't seen what it's like after their board gets destroyed because they usually win. I don't think they have any cards in their hand. I think it's similar to this where they can put up, a, like I said, they can put up a board, but if they can't destroy your monster, then they can't really do anything. And he did even, he even got rid of my monster. Now he probably did fuck up. You guys let me know. I don't know. I think he played the, like I said, every time I've seen the deck play, that's what they do. Um, that's the board they end on. Like I said, he, he couldn't go to Boral Swords. I think that probably was the problem, but yeah, that does mean, no, because if he went Boral Sword, he wouldn't be able to go Unicorn, so... I think I was still a re, like a still re, I got it. I'm definitely gonna save this replay, but so Stridus, I'd attack, draw, and discard. So this while I control Link Monster, which I do, your opponent cannot target monsters you control for attacks except this one, and your opponent cannot target monsters you control for card effects except this one. So if we had Executor, which we can technically put in this deck now because, like I said, of the Chalice Slime, if we can put Executor and Quantum on the field with a Link, they're not able to do shit. 
or they can attack this but like i said at the start of the damage step it just bounces something back then i can make it a second attack so i can literally bounce unicorn back and then make a second attack to kill this that would have been what 400 right that would have been 400 20 24 27 over 13 would have been 14 so 14 and 4 is 18 so you would have been left with 62 and then 24 and 39 which would have been 60 oh that was actually game huh right yeah that was game that was game by i think 150 i think this yeah 6350 all together whoo that's what i'm talking about man we definitely got to save that goddamn replay man we'll be right back folks Ooh, that is a return to form man my birthday did not turn out how it, it it was supposed to turn out and my god i was very upset but it it i'm fine now i'm fine now man you see this is why i love the orcus and then i told you guys about these w rituals chalice slime it doesn't hurt i understand the, the before before chalice slime these hurt because there's not really too many ways to get both of them off the field that was the problem like the, the ones that came out before was the four and the six so it's either you get rid of the six or you get rid of the four there's not really too many situations where you can get rid of both but now since they only bring out one monster because of chalice slime you're just able to easily get rid of it and like i said um you could just send a slayer to the graveyard man and it's just helpful mistake showed itself i believe game one but not game technically game game two i actually it would have helped it would have helped out a lot because then he wouldn't be able to got you would have got to have his shit i believe um and then that like so if we would have went first we would have won anyways but um uh, man the orf this is why i love the orcus engine man it just helps so freaking much i'm trying to tell you guys it helps so freaking much um, see that that's what I'm talking about the the the, the comeback factor that Orcus that Orcus presents itself is just too good and off the cost of what four cards one two three four five technically it's just it's just really good and they're like oh my god man, I'm just loving the way this deck is playing man my only thing that like I would say was just try to fit in some hand traps that is the only thing I can technically put in so if you guys don't want a main mistake you can definitely cite it and then main ash um this is why i say dark hole regeki is always good man i mean not always good but definitely good in this format so i definitely have to put that in a deck um we can literally put it in here let's put it as you know 44th and 45th but you know what let's let's just do that so next game um we're gonna get another game because that was just fun that was just really fucking fun um yeah so uh you know what no 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 we're gonna we can keep that one that's gonna be the one video for today next week we will be playing with dark hole and regeki um in in the list um so yeah man hope you guys did enjoy the video hope you guys like i said man spam that like button man hope you guys stayed to the end because man that was a good ass duel that was a good ass goddamn duel right there man see man that 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 just that's that's the that's 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 just the great shit about you man it can bring you out the dumps it can really bring you out the dumps man and then that's what that that i mean that's what that video i mean that's what that duel did I and mean, it was just a great great back and forth duel not really back and forth but he went off he showed his ass and I said, all right, I'm going to sit back and let's see what you can do. He could not kill me. And bam, the minute, the minute, bros, the minute I had just like the perfect hand, man. I was able to, you know, the chalice slime got me the candle to force out the fog blade. Then after that, um, the foolish burial with the necro, shinobi necro, man. Uh, 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 man, that is good. Oh, man, that was wonderful. Thank you guys for watching, though. Thank you. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. And if you guys uh, did enjoy the video, leave a like and leave a comment. And also subscribe if you haven't already. Um, I know I missed a video on Friday, but folks, listen, it was just it was just a collection of things. Uh, most likely it won't happen again. Uh, I can't guarantee you, man. I am human. So sh shit does happen. Um, so, yeah. But like I said, man, I hope you guys did enjoy that video tomorrow. Uh, Wednesday's video um wait i don't know if it's when it, it might either be a video tomorrow or on wednesday i'm not sure how i want to do the schedule i don't really want to uh, i don't want to miss an uh, upload and i don't want to like over overwork you guys hope you guys you know don't enjoy it and stuff and it's just too much videos because i know a lot of people are you know starting you know oh, why you keep playing some this is zombie channel i'm sorry this, it, i'm just too excited right now but anyways uh we'll talk about all that stuff later um probably most likely wednesday so if, if i do do tuesday it's gonna be a uh just a, a fun i do have a very video I, I do have a video i do i do want to try though i do want to try it i want to see how you guys like it well i really wanted to do it on saturday i'll probably do it maybe tuesday when i don't know i'm gonna try to do it this week 
um and then hopefully you guys if you guys do like it then that could be just a either once a month twice a month or you know pretty much every end of the week thing that can definitely be uh you know a, a video that I, I can put up anyways thank you guys for watching hope you guys did like comment uh if you guys hope you guys did and if you did like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and if you guys want to help the channel out links are in the description down below man you guys can either donate to the channel using the links the two links in the description which is my email or no not me email, my uh, patreon or my paypal or you guys can uh you know click an ad to help support the channel any help is you know it's helpful and i appreciate all of it Thank you guys for watching. I will be back the next time you see me, uh, most likely Wednesday.